Hello everyone, my name is Vincent, and today we are going to be playing Miyasso, which is a in or not an indie, a uh, RPG horror game. <clears throat> it uh, follows the lines of like Crooked Man and Nero Oni and that kind of stuff. So, without further ado, let's get the show on the road. Of course, it is a scary RPG, like most RPG games. Uh, enter this girl's name with the keyboard. Okay, then. I'm just gonna pick a random name. Uh, sure, why not? Aki, I guess. I didn't type it in. Help. No. How about no? Nope. One sec, real quick. Let me do something real quick. Hold on. Uh, okay. Probably make a difference. Alright. Find me. No. How about no? Aki. Ah, uh, Miyaso. Is that you, Miyaso? Miyaso! And a lot of these games are, uh, have a lot of, um, reading, so bear with me here. Uh, it's more enriching with the story, so. Was I dreaming? I thought I heard Miyaso. I guess it was just a dream. It's been three months. Oh no, it's so late. I'm gonna be late for school. A lot of these RPG games start with dreaming, I don't know why. Like a nightmare or something. Miyaso never stood out too much in, in our class. She was just a simple girl, really. I wasn't too close to her, but I always worrying about Miyaso being alone. I hoped I could be her friend, but that didn't happen. Three months ago, Miyaso went missing. She wasn't coming to school, and she hadn't come home either. She's not the type of to she's not the type to flee home. Our parents were saying that she might have gone involved in something. Well, I'm off. Our class spread our class spread the rumor that Miyasa was long dead by now. Shit, who does that? I really hope they're wrong. I wanted to be your friend. Who gets that involved? Who cares that much? Find me. All right then. And I'm kind of stunned how this is running out of... I know I talk about frame rates. I don't know why I've been talking about FPS recently a lot more than usual, but this is running at a solid 60, like, fluently. So, here, then you have... The attractive teacher of Aki's class popular with students of his generosity. Mr. S showed a shoot Mr. S as cool as ever. Dot dot dot. That voice I heard in my dream, was that me also? Who's that obsessed, dude? You've got guts to ignore my lecture. How did he know she was ignoring him? She just looked to the left for one nanosecond. Jeez. This information will be essential to the test, so you better listen. Hashtag every teacher known to mankind. Yes, sir. I'm sorry. Giggle? Who the fuck giggled to that? It's not even funny. Is she crying now? What the hell? Okay. Black screen. Mr. Shoda, Mr. S, I'm just gonna say Mr. S, has a new suit. Like, whoa, super suave. What? Aki's best friend, a fad, a fad following girl who looks up to Mr. S. Aika, you've been talking... You've been talking him up all morning. Don't you ever get tired of blabbing? My exact sentiment. But he's such a ladies man. He's so nice and smart and the best. Oh girl, just, <laughs> just chill out, man. Oh yeah, I gotta use some hand cream. Um, no comment. Did you hear? I did. He, there's a rumor Mr. S had a fan, a hand fetish. Dude, that's fucking dust right now. She's putting hand lotion on herself just to attract him. What the fuck? So maybe if I clean my hands constantly every day all the time, he'll like me more. I don't really care. <laughs> oh my god. That's probably the single best line in video game history. Sarcasm there. Don't really care, she, she says. Ha, huh, you've got no eye for men, Aki. Seriously, what do you see in a, sed a seducer like Tohi? Toma, like Tohama. Hey, I I never said I liked anybody. I just 
think he's kind of cool, that's all. Really? Nee hee hee hee. Yes, really. Dude, my hands are fucking greasy. There's been some spooky paranormal business going on at the school. I'm getting a little freaked. Paranormal my ass. Aki's classmate, a boy carefree in appearance, personality, and everything. I'm for real. It's for real. The other day, a kid in the other class got dragged away in the bathroom. This is giving me some corpse room vibes right here. Aki's classmate, leader of the bullies. Oh, okay, just flat out say it. Kudo. There was a lot of- there was also the glass in the third floor hallway being broken from inside. Aki's classmate, a calm, early maturing youth. Gotta be ghosts. Eek, I'm scared. Aki's classmate, just a Tomi for short. Toma's girlfriend. Ghost, huh? Dumbass, they- those ain't exist. Those ain't exist. Wait. What if this Miyasa's curse? Look, this is no time for jokes. But I mean, it's totally possible. It's been three months since she vanished, and then this stuff just suddenly starts. If those, ev if those events are Miyasa's curse, then Yoshino will be cursed sooner or later. Hmm, whatever did I do? Yoshino, you did bully Miyasa a lot. Bullying? Why, I never. I was just making little fun. And Tomi always screwed with me also. You're the only one who got cursed. Meh? Me? Ha, huh, I'm fine. Me also looked up to me. I wonder. Tahama, I'm scared. I mean, I'm your girlfriend. Me also might have a grudge. Don't sweat it, Otomi. I'll protect you. Aw, you're so nice. Pa, what do you... Ugh, do what you like, lovebirds. Miyaso, please don't curse us. The rest of- the rest are fair game, though. Oops, did I say that out loud? The heck? Earthquake just happened. Oh, snap. Well, it got dark right qu right quick. Quickly. What the heck's going on? Maybe just maybe. It really is Miyaso's curse. Miyaso's real mad at us. Sh shut up. What the hell? I was just kidding about the curse crap. You were clearly, n clearly not just kidding about the curse. Help. Miyaso? Miyaso? I can hear her speaking to me. I wish I could. Oh no, oh now it's gonna be her. Sh shut up, I don't hear her damn voice. Aki, you, you talking crazy talk. I'm not. Uh, find me. M Miyaso? Dang. What? What? Alright, so we got, uh, the curse of Miyaso, quote-unquote, happening, I guess. You finally come to. Where am I? I was just in the classroom. Who are you? I am a Nagawa. Oh my goodness. Doesn't he look like the same guy from, uh, Madfather? Like, the exact same guy. This is the exact same character model they used. Luckily for you, you've ended up somewhere safe. Ended up? After the earthquake, the school was sucked into another world. What? This sent those inside flying all across the school. Another world? What's that supposed to mean? And why would that happen? Well, it's a curse. Miyaso's curse. It is the result of a girl's curse that the school was sealed in the other world. A curse? It couldn't be. Miyaso? Man, they've probably said Miyaso a million times, and I don't know anything about this Miyaso. I wish they would do some kind of flashback or something. Be nice to know. Pant, pant. Finally made it. I thought I was a goner. So you finally returned, Miss Library? She is, in, she is the school's vice principal. Always in the library, so that's what, I, we, that's what we call her. 
So then, Miss Library, how does it look? It's messed up and gunked up and funked up. Funked up? Good gravy, That that's just... Okay then, that's a play on words. The foundation and everything is wrecked and I, and I haven't been able to find any exits. Plus, evil spirits are going and attacking people. I saw a student kill before my eyes. Oh my goodness. This is really... Talk about build-up, man. I'll never be able to eat hamburgers again. Ugh. So I see. Thank you for your report. You may retire for now. Yes, well, I'm going back to the library. Call me anytime you need. So she's going... So, wait. She saw someone die from a ghost before her eyes, and now she's just going to casually go back to the library? How is she going to go back to the library? Carefully? I would. I wouldn't even risk it. I would stay with people. What's the point of doing that, anyway? Jeez, th this is... I don't know, man. I don't know. Evil spirits. The curse must have summoned them. The school is now a den of spirits, and there's nowhere to run. There's only one solution. Undoing the girl's curse. There's surely no other way. How am I supposed to undo a curse? By saving a girl's soul. Miss Aki, you must know what it is that you have to do. I do? Yeah, because we're the player. Of course we know what to do. It's my gaming instincts. Miyasa was calling me. She, So she wants to be found. Mr. Anigawa. I will be looking for Miyasa. So you will. As library informs me, the school's full of evil spirits, and yet, and yet you wish to go. But on the contrary, library just decided to head back to the library. Unless the library is right next to this room. It seems arbitrary. I will. Because Miyasa is my friend. So you want to tell yourself? Understood. You are entrusted with the fate of the school. I believe you can do it. If you encounter any trouble, pay a visit to the library on the second floor, she'll try her best to help. Okay, so that rolls out that the library is right next to this room. If you wish to make a record, please talk to me. I will do so for you anytime. Will you save? Of course we'll save. Alright. You can also press C or Shift to make a quick save. Deleted when game is closed. You can ask the library for more details. I'll pr I pray for your safety. Can I move at all? Okay, it's the arrow keys. So finally, we're playing the game. So there's your story. We have people talking about Miyasa. There, she was bullied. Blah blah blah. Cliche. And she cursed the school apparently and took them to another dimension. So our we are going to try to find Miyasa here. Um, I might actually just save that for the next episode because, uh, just because anyway. Um, I'll upload this and the second part so it's not just heavy rich, uh, you know, story so you can get gameplay. So, thank you for watching part one of Miyasu. Next part, we'll try to find this Miyasu and see what she, uh, why she wanted to curse this place in the first place. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.